Hey guys, what's up? It's your CNC Star Director here, Angie Tellerico Dalton. Today's video is gonna be my first haul video for spring summer 2022. So before we get to that, if you are new here, please subscribe. And also I have a Wickless Weekly email newsletter that I create that goes out every Thursday and then some exciting days in between with a special perk for new subscribers. Also, if you really never want to miss a beat in the Cincy world, please just text Wickless and it will subscribe you to my Wickless Charm a VIP text. Okay guys, this is going to be a good haul. So let's go ahead and dive on in. First thing in the box. First thing. Let's talk about the famous <laughs> cotton cleanups. So cotton cleanups are officially back on the website in the catalog through your Cincy consultant. These are back and they are back for regular purchase, not just Cincy club members. They just went super, super crazy popular over the last like year and a half. And we had a hard time keeping them in stock, but they're back. They're back for regular purchase. You don't have to do a Cincy club just to get your cotton cleanups. You can add them to your Cincy club, of course. Um, but the cotton cleanups come with a pack of 25 cleanups that usually fill up about three or four warmers of mine. So it really just depends on how many like wax cubes you use in each warmer. Um, and a pack of 25 is $10. So the price did go up because of materials and how life is right now, but they're back. So went ahead and got a couple of packs before they were to go out of stock for a while again. So um, next, let's see. So I have two full boxes probably of wax. This is also my order with my Charm Crate stuff for February. Um, a part of the Charm Crate is coming separately for some reason they wanted to the, like the car bars and it wanted to ship separately so that's not actually in this order um but next we have my whiff box so after this haul i'm actually gonna film my whiff box unboxing um yeah the order came in a little later than usual this time um it arrived on saturday i believe and that was maddie's birthday so of course i didn't have a chance to actually sit down and film anything um this is my first work day since i've had this order in but you know that's pretty typical with a new catalog launch. Everybody's getting orders, everybody's placing orders, and there's a lot for Cincy to, you know, to get ready and ship out to you. So it's normal during like high traffic periods for shipping to be a little slower than usual. And then also we've had like crazy weather in a lot of parts of the, uh, the nation, you know, recently. Not here, we don't have a lot of snow here, um, but you know, everywhere else. So we actually have a counter clean and make a splash. I don't know how I missed it, but dude, I missed it. Like make a splash is also available in the full cleaning line, not just coastal sunset. So like coastal sunset really got showcased in the catalog as the new cleaning scent, but make a splash is also available too. So I went ahead and got me a new counter clean and I've been meaning to share it on my stories, but this is the coastal sunset counter clean that I got in my new season sales kit for customer, no, for consultants, sorry. I've been meaning to share it because, can you hear that? Literally, we used this thing up, it's dry. Like there's no, there's no, like no counter clean left. So this literally came perfect timing so I can try out the Mega Splash in counter clean. This whole order isn't my order, but a lot of this is my personal order, of course. So next, I'm so excited to show you these. So we have a lot of hand soaps. The new hand soaps. Look how cute and short and stubby they are. I love them. Coconut Daiquiri is a scent that was actually in our 2021 summer collection and now it's back in the full body line. So that's the only line that it's back in. It's not available as a wax or anything, but you can get Coconut Daiquiri, which is coconut milk, banana, and vanilla cream now in the body line. So hand soap, hand cream, body cream, Scentsy Soak, body wash, uh, fragrance mist. It's available in the whole body line. And then also we have Make a Splash available in the entire body line as well. These new bottles, they're bigger. They're a little, a few dollars more. So it went from a $6 bottle to a $9 bottle but it went from a, I think it's like a 7.7 .7 fluid ounce bottle maybe to an 11 fluid ounce bottle. So they are a few dollars more, but they are 
it's more product. So a new design, a new pump. This is the Make a Splash, which is Dewy Melon, Green Apple, and Turquoise Water. I love this. And this is actually the hand soap that is in the Charm Crate. So we have a bunch of hand soaps. Have a bunch of hand soaps. And if I could hold these all in one hand for you guys, I definitely would. But I don't think I can physically do that without dropping them all. And these are not all my hand soaps. So I don't want to drop them everywhere because I don't want to whisk, whisk. I don't want to whisk wiking them. <laughs> um, make a splash. But I, I really love the hand soaps. I think they're so, sh they're short and stubby. And I think, I think they're precious. So um, before we actually open up the boxes of wax and stuff, I wanted to show you three bars that were, they were like packaged in like the big box, but they weren't actually in like the wax boxes this is big hero 6 so the big hero 6 collection launched i want to say last week last monday and we have the baymax scentsy buddy and the scent pack and the scentsy bar in would you like a hug and guys so we have three of these three of these boxes here in this order this scent it's like what what I don't remember. It's like raspberry and vanilla cream, maybe it and marshmallow. Maybe. Oh my goodness, it's delicious. It reminds me of scents like Berry of Paradise, Sun and Berry. Um, what was the other one? I was literally about to say Berry Fairy Tale. It reminds me of scents like that. It's like a starburst. Oh my, it's like a red starburst. It's so good. I have not warmed it obviously because I've been waiting for this haul. Um, but I cannot wait to warm this and try out the fragrance because it's delicious. Like, if this has a great performance, this might be club worthy. So, I'm just going to go ahead and call that now. So, now we have two more boxes. I need to open these. So, wait, wait, wait. I can do that better. Hang on. BRB. Okay, in this box on the top, we have some pods. So, some, a lot of pods were returning pods from last year. So we have some hibiscus pineapple, which is a very great scent. And then cocoa lime also came back this year with, of course, Vampire Beach, thankfully. And we have a lot of new pods this year, too. So we have a lot, including one of my favorite scents ever. This is Coastal Sunset. I am trying to focus it. Coastal Sunset, man. Like, this is... This is the summer, or this is the year. This is the season. <laughs> what am I trying to say? Coastal Sunset and Mega Splash. They have big things going on this year. I love these two scents. Mega Splash is also available in pods. I just haven't actually reached down to find them yet. We have more hand soaps, all in Mega Splash. More hand soaps. Oh, and we have some laundry in this one. So the last box is probably all the wax. More hand soaps. More hand soaps. Like I said, this is a charm crate item. So lots and lots and lots of hand soaps. And then we have some laundry. So here is the laundry liquid. This is one of the two new laundry scents in this catalog. This is Magnolia Linen. I I know this one is for me. I called it last year. It was last year whenever Magnolia Linen first released. I'm pretty positive it was and I called it. I was like, this would be a perfect laundry scent. And since he loosened. So <laughs> Magnolia Linen is actually back again in the full catalog. It's also available as pods, I believe, and I know a car bar and, and it's in the whole laundry line. So this one is Oh, it doesn't have the actual sit notes on there, but we also have a counter clean of Coastal Sunset, another full counter clean, and then we have the washer whiffs of Magnolia Linen. Oh, let me, let me show you. These are heavy. So like I said, um, Magnolia Linen is now available in the full laundry line, so that includes the washer whiffs, the laundry liquid, the dryer disc, and the scent soft, and the the, the Cincy Fresh, sorry, <laughs> the Cincy Fresh spray that took forever to get out. So I think it's really pretty. I love the packaging. Um, it's just such a good, like, clean linen, but it also has that, like, 
I don't know, like I wanna say feminine, feminine note to it as well, so. Got some washer riffs. Okay, up next we have a box full of some car bars, sin circles, pods, wax, etc. And then we also have the new warmers. So I have already unboxed the new warmers in this haul that are my personal warmers. And I can't wait to show you. So that will be last on the list, but I have them unboxed and ready to go because I wanted to show you like firsthand like what these actually look like, not in the box. So but until then, we have a lot of white teak and amber scent circles. So this is a charm crate item. Got lots of them. Um, let's see, let's see. So we have some pods. I grabbed a car bar. I need to get this box out of the big box so I don't break my back. But we have some make a splash pods. Yep. So like I said, this scent is now available in pods, which is super exciting. And then we have two packs of dryer disc in magnolia linen. So here is the box. The dryer disc are the extra scent boost that you put into the actual dryer. It's a little bar. Each box comes with two. So whenever you purchase a Laundry Love bundle, you actually get two boxes of dryer disc, which means you get four disc total. So these each one lasts for about 15 medium loads you literally just keep throwing it in there until the fragrance is gone so it usually lasts me a lot longer than 15 loads that's just my personal opinion um and it's just an extra fragrance booster just like the the washer whips are fragrant boosters so next we have two blueberry cheesecake car bars so classic car bars got two of these and then like I said, we have a lot of new spring and summer car bars, but they are shipping separately from this order. I'm not ex exactly sure why. Hopefully they'll be in soon. I do know I, I got an order from UPS saying I have an order coming in this week. So hopefully that's them. But we have some, we have Coastal Sunset, Make a Splash, Pink Sugarberry Mint, Magnolia Linen. Magnolia Linen. What was it? Coastal Sunset, Make a Splash, Magnolia Linen, Pink Sugarberry Mint, and we have another one. What was it? We have another call bar, and I cannot think of what it is. Ah, I can't think of it, but we have five brand new ones, I believe. Oh, I know what it is. It's Watermelon Tangerine. I see the wax right here, and that's what made me remember. So now we have a lot of wax. I'm going to try my best to not keep this box right next to my microphone. Um so that it doesn't kill your ears. Okay, so in the waxes, we have Summer Moonlight. This is my number one favorite of the brand new releases. It's never been available before. I'm trying to focus it, but I don't think it is. Come on now, come on camera. There we go. Uh, this is Summer Moonlight. It, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It smells like a perfume mist that I would have had in middle school. Like every day it kind of reminds me a little of lucky in love but this is my this is my number one favorite out of the brand new releases like the brand 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 new releases then we have bonfire beach bonfire beach is now back thankfully y'all know how much i love that one uh magnolia linen is back not just in the laundry line but it's back as a car bar and wax and all the above pretty much then we have a coastal sunset which is this is now one of my favorite, like, all-time fragrances. Like, this is one of my, I can't live without, I will use it year-round fragrances. Coastal Sunset. I'm so happy and so ready for the car bar to be available. Uh, Sand Swept came back. Sand Swept was new last summer. And I really, really liked that one. That one is more of a, it's in the citrus fragrance family, I believe. But it is, like, just one of those scents. Where you're like, you don't want somebody to, you don't want it to be obvious that you have fragrance going on in your home, but you want your home to like naturally smell good and fresh and clean for like spring and summer. That's what Sand Swept is. It's, it's so good. Uh, Pink Sugarberry Mint. Do you remember this one? This was a scent of the month last year. I believe it came out with the Birds of a Feather Warmer. This is now back. I honestly was surprised by this. I mean, yeah, I've liked it and I really like the performance of it. I just, I guess I was surprised 
to see it back in the catalog, you know, instead of like some other things. Like, I don't know, like it was popular, but it wasn't like so popular where I was like, that for sure is coming back like, like next year. Like Coastal Sunset, I was like, that's coming back. But Pink Sugarberry Mint, it's, it's a car bar now. The very good spring bakery scent. Very creamy. Oh, good. So, I'm very happy that it's coming back and it's getting some more time to shine. Uh, Watermelon Tangerine is back. This one was a, a summer collection scent some years ago. Then it came back in the catalogs and so it's been a spring and summer scent ever since. And now it's going to be a car bar. So, very excited for Watermelon Tangerine. So good. Oh, these scents are just like so bright and uplifting. Like, they just put me like in the best mood. Okay, we have four Summer Moonlight. This is the, I'm pretty positive this is the scent that I put in the charm crate this month. And then we have a Make a Splash. So good. I've been using my Make a Splash body wash. Um, they put the body wash in the new console in like the new season sales kits in January. And so I've been using that and I really like it. Paradise Punch. Just the perfect like fruit punch scent ever and then rainbow sherbet rainbow sherbet i can't talk rainbow sherbet is back another great fruity delicious scent for this season we have more summer moonlight we have four more oh i'm trying so hard not to drop stuff so we have four more of these and then we have some returning ones so we have mahalo coconut which actually didn't steal my heart until like last year is that focused? Don't know. I can't tell. I'm sorry. I needed an assistant. This is my Hallow Coconut. Um, the first year it came out, like I wasn't, like it was good and I knew I liked it, but like I wasn't crazy about it. I became crazy about it last year. I like just finished up my Mahalo Coconut body cream from the Mother's Day collection last year. I had been like hoarding it, like really saving it. And then I finally had to throw it away. Like it was empty. I couldn't squeeze out any more body cream of the Mahalo Coconut. Um, Prickly Pear and Agave is back, thankfully. So I love this one. I remember I hated that one whenever it first came out. And then my nose has just evolved. I gave it a second chance and now I really love it. It reminds me a lot of sea salt and avocado. Up next, we have Mad from Melon. This one's back from last year. Very happy about that too, because I really liked that scent. And a brand new one. This is Apple Teeny Splash. So this is a brand new release. I really like it. I think that was one that Brennan was just not a fan of. But I really like it. So another Coastal Sunset. Then we have another Summer Moonlight. Tangerine Creamsicle is back. <laughs> so delicious. Tangerine Creamsicle. It's absolutely delicious. Another Sand Swept. And a Clementine Cupcake. This is one that reminds me of like a more... I want to say orange, but like a clementine version of vanilla bean buttercream. So, this one's a brand new release. I really, really, really like that one. More Summer Moonlight. We have five more of these with a number, a number, another, <laughs> another Apple Teeny Splash. I don't think I've ever went one day of my life without messing up some form of my verbal communication. We have some more. Summer Moon Lot, five more of these. And then we have another new one. This one is Shoreline Drive. This one I really, really like. This is a brand new release. It is a fresh scent. And it is just like, just that. It reminds me of driving down a beach. Like the road next to a beach. What am I trying to say? It, <laughs> driving in a convertible with your hair just blowing in the wind. I'm trying to be way too dramatic, but it reminds me of being in a movie. Honestly, that's what it reminds me of. It reminds me of being in a movie where you're driving in a convertible with a top off and your hair is flying everywhere and you just smell that beachy, salty air. <clears throat> it smells so good. I've never actually done that, or if I have, it was a very long time ago. So, um, but only five more left. Last but not least in the waxes, we have another Sherlon Drive. And then a white ember antique. This is my number two favorite. And they're brand new releases. This is Brennan's favorite. This is just, man, since he nailed this one, this is just that 
perfect men's cologne, masculine, woodsy, musky scent. White Amber Antique. This, people are going to go crazy about. So we got two of these. Two of those. And then we have two pink rhubarb sugar. So this is actually another brand new scent. This is delicious. <sighs> pink rhubarb sugar. It's just sweet and fruity. Sweet and fruity. So if you love scents like Sun Wrap and Berry, if you love the Big Hero 6, if you love, uh, what am I trying to say? It's, it reminds me of Starburst. It reminds me of Starburst. So, mm, so good. Okay, so now let's talk about the warmers. I have everything unboxed. I'm so excited. This is my favorite one. This is Summer Rain. <coughs> This, I don't want it to click like that. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna take this off for a second and show you. So this is the Summer Rain Warmer. I believe this is a $55 warmer, maybe. Let me double check before I tell you. Um, this is a brand new warmer. And this is a, yes, it's a $55 warmer. So, the thing about this, I'm gonna read the description for you and everything. It is a unique texture, gives the impression of water running down the surface while a beautiful iridescent shine radiates like a rainbow after a storm. I'm so obsessed. It takes a 25 watt bulb and it's six and a half inches tall. So let's zoom in and look at this thing. So this is the warmer that everybody's been going absolutely nuts about. It is iridescent. It's like it's pink, but it's purple, but it's also clear and neutral at the same time. I have been wondering if the like the raindrops were on the outside or the inside of the glass and they're on the outside. So it's textured. Oh, I just love it. It has a pink di uh, dish that has a four on the center, meaning that since you recommends you can use up to four uh, Wax cubes, regular Scentsy Bar wax cubes to maximize your Scentsy fragrance. Again, it has a 25 white bulb. I haven't even seen this one lit in person because um, I had them open. I wanted to do this haul and I have fresh wax. So I will probably, I will probably put out all my new warmers Thursday whenever I change my wax. So this is the summer rain. Oh my gosh, I'm literally obsessed. Up next, we have the Rooftop Garden, and this is another warmer that's hand-painted. So, that just adds more to the beauty of this warmer. Oh my gosh, it's like a, it is a like neutral gray, so it's gonna match our agreeable gray walls perfectly. This is the Rooftop Garden Warmer. It's a $45 warmer. It says, understated beauty in bloom. The embossed details are hand painted for a little extra pop. It uses a 20 watt bulb and it is six inches tall. So the wax dish is clear, circle wax, di wax dish, and it has a four, meaning that Scentsy recommends you can use up to four regular Scentsy Bar cubes. This is the back. Isn't this look so pretty? I love it. So this is the rooftop garden. It is like, it's like a satin. It's not matte, it's not glossy. It's more of like a satin paint finish. I love how, I also love the texture. I love the texture of it, so very pretty. I think I honestly, I love the flowers on the back the best. That's just my personal opinion, but I love it all the way around. Up next, we have the Pearlescent. This is the one on the catalog, it's so pretty. So the Pearlescent Petals Warmer. It's a radiating, Hand-placed petal design sparkles with eye-catching iridescence. Each warmer features its own nuan nuanced details. Nuanced? Is that what it, that is? It has a 25 white bulb and it's six and a half inches tall. So this one is a glow finish. So definitely it's going to glow um, whenever you actually have it lit up. But I love like, the, the petals on here look glittery. I love it. I almost didn't but purchase this one. But then I was like, I told myself, I love like, the shattered glass type of warmers. This is clicking. Sorry. I love the shattered glass type of warmers. And I knew I just needed it. I knew I needed it. I can't wait to see it plugged up. It has that like bulb type 
um, body. Is that what I'm trying to say? <laughs> I don't know. Guys, I'm so sorry. Okay, I need another coffee. I'm a mom. So you know how we, our brains are just constantly overwhelmed in like spaghetti? Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, but it uses a clear wax dish with a four. So another large warmer, a good warmer for a medium to large space. So cannot wait to put this one out. Look how pretty. And then last but not least for this haul, this is the mini warmer that I decided to go with. So this mini warmer is going in Madeline's bathroom, which I've decided is gonna be like a boho princess slash Disney theme, just everything Disney, mainly focused around princesses, but then also just of course Disney. And I wanted a warmer that was just gonna match that perfectly. Like right now I have the Lit With Love in there and I saw this and I didn't just see this like in the catalog. I was like, yeah, that's pretty. But then whenever people started showing actual images of it, because this was actually in the new season sales kits for consultants, but it was like the, it was the kit that was all the warmers, but most of the warmers in the kit weren't warmers I personally wanted for the house. So I waited, I just waited till the first to order off my warmers. But this is the crowned in gold mini warmer. So this shiny mini warmer takes geometric glass to new heights with an unexpected gold accent as the crowning touch. It's a $25 mini warmer. All warmers, mini warmers, all mini warmers went up to $25 in this catalog. So it uses a, a 15 watt bulb and it's four and a half in, no, it's four inches tall, sorry. And it is a glass material. So that's important if you want to put this like on a tabletop base. You would need the glass tabletop base, um, meaning for the base. I, oh my gosh, like, this is just beautiful. I showed this on my stories, my Instagram stories, like shining in the direct sunlight and it was just giving off the prettiest iridescent glow, like oh my gosh. But I'm so happy that I chose this one for her bathroom. It's even prettier in person. Like, I don't think it's picking up. Well, it is a little bit, but it's just not, like, <sighs> videos don't do it justice. But mini warmer can use up to two cubes. So you use either one or two regular Scentsy Bar cubes in the mini warmer. And you're golden. So, yeah, guys, that was a big haul. <laughs> Hauls are exhausting. That was so much Scentsy to go through. Now I have to clean up this huge mess. <laughs> and I have to film my Whiff Fox video today. So uh, that's it. I hope you enjoyed. If you haven't purchased or you haven't placed your first spring and summer order yet, like if you've been waiting to watch hauls and see stuff like actual real life images and stuff and get people's opinions, um, I would love to know like, if this helped your opinion or helped you decide what to order um, at all. So that's it. I would love to also hear what have you purchased from the new catalog so far. What are you loving and what do you hope to see from Cincy for this next five months, the five, five and a half months of the spring and summer season. So that's it. Thank you for watching. As always, don't watch me. Join me and have a great day.